so what is the most interesting thing about this shower body is the rain shower so of course we have a damp spout and then if i turn it up we're gonna have a rain shower all right so hey there thank you so much for clicking on this video if you're new here welcome if you're an oldie welcome back in this video i'm finally finally going to do the bathroom reveal after renovation guys i know you've been wanting this one so no long talking just sit back watch the entire video and remember to like share comment and subscribe so guys this air is my bathroom before it was renovated based on the last two videos that i posted you would have seen all the work that was put in to transform this old and outdated bathroom into this two-toned gray and white modern beautiful bathroom so guys it's only right that i give you a tour of my old bathroom and point out some of the changes that was made so like the entrance door we changed that and the medicine cabinet was changed as well as the vanity um we got rid of that diaper genie of course and um next we got rid of well the shower curtain i liked it but um the shower area we had to get rid of that um, porcelain there the tub was still very good so we kept that we changed the window area um shower body was changed and we also um of course put tiles and that floor that which I believe was made from linoleum. We definitely got rid of that. We changed the whole closet area there. The walls were painted. And of course we got rid of that toilet. And now let's take a look at the newly renovated bathroom. Well, finally guys, welcome to my bathroom tour. And bam. So we're going to start with the first thing that we're seeing, which is the medicine cabinet. And I'm going to turn on the light. Alright, so this actually lights up. And it's really sophisticated, guys. I'm not sure if the mirror is, I'm not sure if the video is giving it justice. But um, this is my medicine this, this is my medicine cabinet. No, I'm not gonna open it because you already know what is kept inside a medicine cabinet. All right, so down below we have the sink area. Uh, this is my hand soap. Just press that, the soap will come out. And really small sink area. And uh, the vanity down below. And this is what I keep inside the vanity. Nothing much. Just some uh, spray bottle stuff and all that. And there's pretty much an empty drawer down below there. Um, next to the vanity and next to the sink area, we got a little towel holder here. So after you wash your hands, you just dry your hands right there. And then I got my little um, balance in the bathroom, you know, to weigh myself. And for the kiddos to weigh themselves as well. I probably should center this a little bit more. So, all right, I'm going to try to give you a full view of this area of the bathroom. All right, so that is that. Now, we are going to go clockwise. So, next, we're going to go into the shower area. Well, first, let's start with the shower curtain. This is just a simple white shower curtain, guys. I don't want to be too extra with it. I just wanted to make sure that it was long enough all the way to the ground and um, plain white. So, actually, so I have a shower curtain and a liner, like an inside piece. So this stays inside and then the shower curtain itself stays outside. All right, so let's start now with the shower area. I'm just going to give you a full view of it before I start talking about anything. So this is it guys, 
full view. All right, so I have two glass shelves in the corner there. And on the shelf, I have a nice fancy soap dish here. In this container here, I have my body wash. And going over, so that's the window there. No worries about that. Nobody can see you from inside if you're taking a shower, by the way. So that's the window right there. And then on the windowsill, I have a candle and three soap dishes that are slanted. So like this, the water from the soap um, doesn't stay and melt the soap. So I really love these soap dishes. And I just have a little plant there. And here is my shower body. So what is the most interesting thing about this shower body is the rain shower. So of course we have a damp spout. And then if I turn it up, we're gonna have a rain shower. All right, so um, that's the rain shower guys. Let me turn it off so I can talk. So the rain shower is literally magical. Like it feels like you're taking a shower in the rain. I absolutely love it. It's one of the it's one of my favorite thing about my new bathroom. So the next thing I want to talk about is this tub. So I actually come to really love this tub. My cousin that in my bathroom said that this is a vent tub. Indeed it is. It's very deep and it just allows me to take a nice sit bath when I feel like it. And the kids do enjoy their sit bath in it as well. So I absolutely love this tub and I'm just glad that I kept it and didn't treat it for a smaller one. And that white thing right there is just the stopper for the water whenever we're taking a sit bath. Alrighty, so this is the shower area. Oh my god, some alarm is going off. Let's just stop the alarm. Alright, so now we're done the shower area. Moving on to the storage. So I'm gonna open this door. It's only right that I show you in here. Alright, so I have one, two, three, four shelves of storage in here. All right, hold on. So I have four shelves of storage in here. Not much stuff is in here right now. <laughs> oh my God, MJ! <laughs> oh my God, here comes MJ. So not much things is in the storage right now. Like guys, don't be fooled. I have a lot of things to store in here but i'm trying to figure out how i'm going to organize them but for the video's sake i'm just keeping it light but like on the top there i'm going to have my extra towels and rags and this shelf here is going to be for marlon's stuff and this one here is going to be my stuff and this one here is going to be for the kiddos so that they can reach it and we got two baskets down here to um store clothes and stuff like that so yes um this is the toothbrush holder they don't want to have the toothbrushes on display in the video and i got their q-tip holder cotton ball and uh, these are what i used to wipe my makeup off and yeah nothing too serious over there i've got some stuff in that basket nothing too serious extra tissues and pretty much that's it so this is the storage area Ooh. all right so not much more to see here this wall is plain and empty and just have the tissue holder and on top i have a little stand that i put that flower and then on this wall just above the toilet here it says unwind soak breathe relax how perfect and that's the ceiling right there and next we have the toilet and this wasn't the toilet i wanted i wanted the toilet that it like comes straight down on the sides and doesn't have that little you know that little twirl at the bottom or whatever you want to call it because i think like that it picks up too much dust and dirt i think when it's just straight all the way down then it accumulates less dust and dirt so i wanted that but they advertise this toilet that way but 
unfortunately it wasn't as it was just too late it was out of the box ripped up and everything already so i just worked with it so i just want to do a quick demo of how this works all right so i do like this it picks it up and i clean out the bathroom and just simply dispose it in the garbage bin so yeah you know i'm kind of scan full but i really want to touch nothing you know so yeah and then over here now i have this thing here that i keep an extra toilet brush and a plunger so that toilet brush i will just use for um you know regular cleanup you know not messy cleanup and then the plunger you already know what a plunger does also i think a plunger should be disposable as well because the kind of dirty work that a plunger does seriously it gotta go after it's used i have to do my research to see if they have disposable plunger or whatever so on the floor i just have this long runner white carpet you know I mean, like the two piece something something and a piece of something something so yeah this is what i got and absolutely loving it so let's get a view of that So guys, as you can see, you got our good camera. No phone is doing this video. I have an actual camera. I didn't have it, but like, you know, a girl is not a techie, so we have to figure out a few things before I started using it, even though it wasn't much. I hope that like this video quality will be like up to par and better than the others since I'm using a real camera. But anyways guys, we have come to the end of the bathroom reveal video. Let me know what you think. What's your favorite part of the bathroom? What, uh, let me know, is there anything you like? Is there anything that stands out to you? Just let me know in the comment section. And um, remember to subscribe as well. And hit the notification bell. And I'll see you in the next video. Bye-bye.